overflows source of life energy someone asked how to overcome attachment to sex sex is the basic life force your basic existential bio energy but it must transform before i go into details certain things have to be understood first the place where life energy that you know as sex is stored in you is very close to your sex center it is like a kund the sanskrit word pool or reservoir or cistern as a result that energy is known as kundalini the word kundalini comes from this sanskrit word kund gurjeev had called it kunda buffer in tales gurjeev writes about kundalini saint buddha among other things explained to the beings of the pearl land how and to what part of the body of their ancestors the famous organ kunda buffer has been attached kunda buffer at the base of the spine prevents our seeing things as they are it blurs our vision if we saw ourselves as we are we really are we would hang ourselves it is described as a coiled snake that has fallen asleep the moment you disturb the snake from its sleep it raises its hood this is the seed form this is the seed from where everything spreads all over it is important to take into account that whatever pleasure one gets through sex that indeed is not the pleasure coming from sex instead that pleasure is the outcome of the minutest vibration in that pool of energy since this energy is in the form of a sleeping snake whenever there is a slight movement the vibration that arises is known as sexual pleasure ignorantly and unconsciously man considers that pleasure this pleasure as the ultimate and out of ignorance does not want to transcend beyond this however he remains unaware of the bliss arising when the entire energy reaches the brain transcending various layers of the being we live at the first step of this energy ladder there is a still a bigger ladder that takes man to the ultimate this 2 to 3 feet distance <coughs> within us seems unimaginable and unexplored indeed that gap is like the gap from poison to nectar sleep to waking nature to the ultimate matter to being or from death to immortality therefore we consider sex as ultimate indeed sex is part of your unconsciousness indeed it is a blissful experience if it drops by itself and all the attachments are lost if you force it to drop it never drops on the contrary it becomes perverted this is what we see all around us and it starts finding ways from back door 
unless it drops by itself it never really drops meditation is the secret most method of going beyond the body and all that the body contains sex is the part of your body your biology it is not the part of your consciousness consciousness is beyond this energy the moment you start rising up in your consciousness sex is left far behind naturally at the age of 31 one starts wandering something seems to have gone wrong really nothing has gone wrong everything has gone right you should feel blessed that you are free from the greatest imprisonment of your being adam and eve were standing underneath the tree of knowledge looking at the apple in eve's hand eve turned to adam and said after we have eaten the apple we are going to do what after we have eaten the apple we are going to do what naturally the poor woman was not yet aware of what this is the situation of each one of us and they had eaten only one apple it seems you have been eating too many apples all your life then one becomes a quickie little ernie's mother was worried about his progress at school so she took him to see the psychiatrist the shrink decided to give him an aptitude test and asked the nurse to put a hammer a wrench a screwdriver on the table if he grabs the hammer said the shrink he would be a carpenter if he grabs the wrench he will be a mechanic if he grabs the screwdriver he will be an electrician arni fool them all you know what he did he grabbed the nurse this is what we all are doing it does not matter what your age is sex has nothing to do with age it can disappear at any moment or it may not disappear even when your one leg is in the grave it all depends whether your life is just a horizontal phenomena parallel to the earth or something vertical also has entered into it the vertical entry is going deeper into you or that pool of energy is rising upward that verticalness can happen any moment particularly for those who are in meditation you can start moving differently than any other animal is capable of because man is considered as a social animal you can start moving differently than any other animal is capable of except a few men it is unfortunate that i have to say except a few men intrinsically every man is going capable of going beyond sex i have to say it except a few i in intrinsically every man is capable of going beyond 
six. It does not mean that everyone has gone beyond. For that there is a process. You have to go through your journey from unconscious to conscious. Everything you have been doing, whether it is eating, every small or big thing that you do on a day-to-day -day basis is performed like a robot unconsciously. The moment you, the element of consciousness or alertness comes to it and you start doing those same things, little more alert, aware and awake, you grow into consciousness. But people think sex is life. Sex is ultimate. I am not denying its significance. But there are dimensions beyond this which are more important. One should aspire to reach to those dimensions. The moment sex disappears, they think now there is no point in going on living because we have considered sex as the ultimate. Sex was their meaning, their very soul. These are the poorest people in the world who have not known anything beyond the lowest. They have never raised their eyes towards the stars. And this is the biggest problem because of that. This question arises how to remove the attachment to sex. Because you are looking downwards, you have not started looking upward towards the stars, towards the horizon. And the moment you start looking towards the sky, the process begins. And that process begins only through awareness. The moment you are aware of small things, that you perform in life on a day-to-day -day basis, the process of looking upward begins. Enough for now.